Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Sunday. Sunday is a day of rest. It's a day of worship. It's also a day of self-care. And today I want to talk about preserving our beauty using silk or satin pillowcases. I'm transitioning into being natural. And what I notice is that while I may wear a sleeping cap, like this sleeping cap or this turban has the satin lining in it so it helps preserve the natural oils in my hair what i'm noticing is this will come off while i'm asleep and when it does my hair is laying against my cotton or my microfiber pillow and guess what i'm getting a lot of nodding around my hairline as well as i'm noticing that when i wake up my face is so dry i get the pillow lines decreasing you guys and girls know exactly what i'm talking about so i decided to invest in pillowcases this pillowcase is one that i'm actually testing this is a taff silk pillowcase what i like about it is it has the zipper in the inside so that your pillows won't slide out but this one is silk. It does look a bit wrinkly because what I do is I wash them and then I let them air dry. I don't like putting them in the dryer because I don't want them to get faded. Plus, I don't know how silk and heat works together. Now, this one is a satin one. And isn't that print cute? This is so cute. But this is a satin pillowcase. And I got it from Kitschich. Oh, I'm butchering that name, but I saw this online as well, and this is uh, my neck pillow. And the another thing that I like about it is that it has, oops, it has the hidden zipper as well, as you can see. I'm going to unzip it for you guys. Okay, it, oh, there it is. But the zipper is hidden on this one. And I also have this third pillow that I've been testing out. And this one comes from uh, Slip. The thing about it is there's the Slip logo right here. I'm going to... There it is. So you guys can see it. But that's the logo right there. Um, this one as well um, you, is little... What is that stuff in the dryer that's that's on it? But this one does not have um, the zipper for it. You can easily see that the pillowcase is exposed. But this is the black one, the black silk slip. I don't know why it says it's slip, 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 slip. But this is the silk slip pillowcase in black. Now, out of all three of these, I have to say this one is my favorite. And um, I don't like the fact that the zipper, it doesn't have a zipper. I don't like that the pillowcase is exposed. I don't like that at all. However, out of the satin pillowcase and the other silk pillowcase, this one is the softest. Um, it's also the most, the more expensive one. This pillowcase was $89.99 and I got two of them. This uh, video is not sponsored by anyone. Um, I was going to spend the money anyway because I don't like the creasing that I'm getting on my face. Um, I don't like the knotting that I'm getting around my hairline. So I was going to spend the money anyway. And if any of our, you know, you melanated ladies like myself were wondering, like, should you really invest the money in a pillowcase? I would say yes. I noticed that once I put my serums and my moisturizers and my creams on, my face is so smooth and hydrated in the morning. It is like a dream. Your face starts to feel nice like this silk. Um, but I will say that I like the silk ones better. Now, this is Taft. This is a Taft pillowcase, and yes, it's soft, but I, be I don't think that it's the mulberry silk like the slip. I most definitely love the slip, and I'm going to be purchasing more of them. I have a slip headband. I this is not a slip headband, but I have a slip headband, and it you guys, this is just so soft and so smooth. This is just... Wow, this is so nice. I really love it. Oh, 
Yes, I do. Um, my least favorite one is the satin. And I really just think that it's just the texture. Um, once you lay your head on this 100% mulberry silk, you just can't go back. You, you really can't. Um, so I'm taking very good care of this pillowcases. Um, again, they look a little bit wrinkly. I did iron them for this video um, and they do have the um, the little thing that comes on it in the dryer um, that catches the lint. Um, it didn't, that part didn't get out. I probably could have put it on a cool, like natural air dryer um, to get a lot of that lint off, but I know what it is. I know these are clean, so I'm not too concerned about that. But again, this is my least favorite one. Um, and it's just because it's satin. They both do the same thing. These fibers are very good for just maintaining the moisture in your hair. Also with um, your face, your face feels so smooth afterwards. Um, back in the day, we know Cat Williams did the stand up about him having the satin pillowcases for the young ladies that come over and they don't want to wrap their hair up, which he was actually correct. Whatever chick put them on that game, good job, girl, because yes, we do need satin or silk pillowcases, not only for our hair, but for our skin to maintain that beauty, to maintain those different moisture levels, to age grace of, you know, gracefully. You, your body repairs itself while you're sleeping, which is why sleep is so important for your skin, is so important for your weight loss. But I do advise you guys to invest in either satin or silk pillowcases. But me, it's the silk for me, honey, because the silk, is, it just feels so nice. Now, I don't know what kind of silk is used for this. I don't know if um, there's some man-made um, in here on this tab. I'm not entirely sure, but I was going to buy it anyway. It's just that if you purchase one, they will refund you and you give them feedback on it. But I was going to buy it anyway. Um, so I bought two, one for me, one for my hubby. And I bought the same thing with the, uh, the slip. One for me, one for him. And I just got the different colors. Um, I do have another, the satin one from Kishich. Kitchich, kitchich. Ooh, sounds like a bad word almost. But I do like it. I love the print. I really like the print, and it was it was more on the affordable end. Um, I think this one was thirty nine ninety nine. I think this one was around forty ninety nine, and I think this one was seventy nine. 99 to 89 99 but this was the most expensive one um but it's worth it it's the softest um pillowcase the silk i really like this the most but um yeah that is pretty much it i just wanted to stop by on this self-care sunday again hope you guys are having a great sunday and just wanted to give my thoughts and my opinions on um, pillowcases so whether they're silk or satin Go for it. Um, even if you have your regular sheets that are either cotton or microfiber or you have your different thread counts that you do like, go ahead and keep those. But just add a different, you know, just add a pillow in the mix. And you, you will see the results from your skin. Trust me, you will. You put your moisturizer on and you go to sleep. You know, you let you put your serums on, your moisturizer on. You do your whole night care routine. Go to sleep. Wake up in the morning, especially if you are a side or a face sleeper. When you wake up in the morning, you will feel your skin and you would be like, wow. So, go get those pillowcases. Thank you for your time today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out all of my other videos that I have linked down below. And I'll see you guys soon.